Greetings. Happy International Women's Day. Back in 1945, when the UN Charter was adopted, a determined and a vocal group of women from all parts of the world laid the foundation for the women's rights struggle. And in 1977, the UN General Assembly officially proclaimed International Women's Day, which today is observed in every country in the world. This was building on the work of women from the civil society who first celebrated it in 1909. So thank you to civil society. It is their legacy and many more that to take forward as we enter a new area for gender equality, building on 20 years of the Beijing Platform for Action. This year's International Women's Day is the first in the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, where we promise to leave no one behind. The agenda includes a specific goal to achieve gender equality and empower all women and girls. With related targets throughout the other goals, we should be able to do this. This aim to end discrimination and violence against women and girls and to ensure equal participation and opportunities in all spheres of life. In 2015, more than 90 governments answered the UN Women's Call for action to step it up for gender equality. They recommitted to the Beijing Platform for Action and to key areas of concern, such as ending violence against women and girls, women's economic empowerment, women peace and security, and women and girls education. Now, we need action and we need implementation. We need this solidarity more than ever as we face severe population displacement, extreme violence against women and girls, and extensive instability and crisis in many regions of the world. Evidence has shown that women and girls are critical to finding and deploying sustainable solutions to poverty, inequality, and recovery from conflict. They are at the front line of universal challenges such as climate change. On International Women's Day, we reiterate the greater participation of women as an essential condition for the success of an inclusive agenda 2030. The underrepresentation of women in decision-making bodies, gender-based violence and unpaid care work are all structural barriers to gender equality. And ensuring the resilience of women in the face of adversity is key to achieving the sustainable development goals. The participation of women of all ages, at all levels, young, old, disabled, LGBTQI and minorities is needed. Our work has to prioritize the most vulnerable, the most needy, the least served, so that truly there is no one that is left by the wayside on the road to 2030. Together, we must make sure that decisive, visible, and measurable actions are taken as we march forward under the banner, Planet 50-50. Step it up for gender equality. Thank you.